Just unfair. So fate. what do you think of the match? Um, it was a fun, fantastic. Uh, can you take us through the, the first half yeah, and the second the half? Yeah, sure. The first, the first half was a bit scrappy. We needed to come out. We needed to play our football. They did that in the second half. And as the game went on, you knew we were going to score. But were we really going to score? Who knows? And we waited and waited and waited. And then it was a brilliant, a brilliant penalty from Bannon. You just knew that he had to score. And the thing with Wednesday is we've had these chances to go third and we keep blowing them and blowing them. But this time we've won. We've got the points. We are third and there's a really good chance now. We go into the new, new year in a great position and with Leeds in the top top two slipping up, who knows, you might end up second. You know, you've got to keep winning, keep everybody fit. All right, so what do you say to the Leeds fans and uh, the teams around you? Oh, Leeds always blow it, don't they? Everybody knows that Leeds blow it and they're going to do it again. It's whether Wednesday can maintain the form and end up round about that same place. You know, if we get in the playoffs, fine, but if we come second, that would be brilliant. Yes, and uh, band, man of the match, uh, was it deserved? Yeah, he's a fantastic player. He's our best con consistent player in the whole team. You know, he just binds the team together. Some brilliant passes. Some some days he's not quite as good as others, but today he was good. And with Fletcher not being there, he stepped up. He was brave. He took the penal penalty. It was great that he scored. Fantastic. Everybody's gone home really happy. It sets up Christmas perfectly. Okay, and then you uh, near the end, was it a bit jittery? You had five extra minutes. Yeah. So. Quite a lot of the home games in recent months, we've we've been leading, and then we've ended up being pegged back to draw. And everybody knew that that was a possibility, but the team have got a bit more resilience about them now, and they just got the ball, controlled it. It was still quite nervous as a fan, but it was brilliant when the whistle went and we had the points. Right. Okay. So uh, tell us, have you been a fan all your life? Uh... Yeah. Yeah. I've been I've been coming since since I was six. I'm now 48, and my kids my kids come. I drive all the way here from Cambridgeshire every match. That's, 180 miles here, 180 miles back. Um, wow, that's season fantastic. ticket hold, holder, love the club. Yeah, so, so um, just imagine that, uh, you know, well, uh, so, uh, Wednesday got fans all around the country then. Oh, they've got fans absolutely everywhere. You know, as I drive up on the motorway, I see the same cars, most matches, and that's fans coming from London and all, all over the place as well. So it's an absolutely brilliant club to follow. So. Come and you Wednesday. go to away matches as well? Yeah, I go to some away games, not all the away games, but yeah, season ticket holder at home. So for us, most home games are actually away games in terms of the distance we, we travel. So Right, brilliant. so what do you say uh, to the next match? To the Is it Stoke you'll play? Um, we play Hull on Boxing Day, don't we, oh, at yeah, home? Yeah. yeah, I mean, yeah, you know, as long as we can be consistent and keep, keep getting points, basically, we're going to make Hillsborough a fortress where teams don't want to come here and play us, and we've just got to keep piling the points on. Who knows? Great, okay, thanks. All right, Cheers. pleasure.